name is Avery, and today we're going to be discussing the game feel and the velocity and acceleration of Mario. So how Mario works is that he has his own set velocity, and this velocity grows up at a certain amount of time, and usually the game set this to 10 frames per second. And whenever he accelerates, his deceleration is always going to be the exact same rate. So if you're running, it's going to slowly build up until he reaches his max speed. And as soon as you let go of the button, it's going to drop to his, slowly drop down at the exact same rate to it back to zero. So as you can see right here in this, my game engine that I have, I just made a short little Mario clone. And Mario runs around and he has his own velocity where it accelerates as you run around. And whenever you have to do a sharp turn, he'll quickly have to slow down his, say, his left speed and so he can pick it up on his right speed. And we're going to jump into the code and I'll show you guys how this works. So first off, we're going to be growing his velocity by accelerating him as he goes left or right. So if he's going left, we're going to be going negative and right is going to be positive. So let's say he's already going right, for example, his speed is at 2. If you want to go left, you're not going to quickly drop to 0 and start building and accelerating. You're going to just accelerate from where he's already going. So if he's going to, you're just going to drop by a little notch every single time until you get to zero, and then you'll keep going. And along with that, whenever you s release the button, you're not moving left or right. It's slowly going to move back at the exact same speed, back to zero. There's also a max speed, like we saw in the graph. This is going to be the cap. So once he reaches that, he can't go any further than that. That's as fast as Mario can go. Now there's an one extra thing. This right here is in the Mario games where you can hold down the B button. As you hold the B button, it makes it so you can run even faster. So we're making it so its max speed is even higher. So to test this in the code, we just check for the B button and we'll just set the new max speed to this. As you can see, he's running around. This is about holding B. And then he switches to B and it changes its max speed. So in this short video, I just wanted to show you guys how you can use Mario's game mechanics and his physics for walking and running in your own games. And it's just as easy as that. I'm going to be making a video sooner or later. We're going to be showing how to eat Mario makes his jump. But if you guys are new here, feel free to like and subscribe. If you have any questions, leave a comment below and see you guys next time.